Okay, bye. All right. Jim will be back later on. Okay. He'll be back later on. Welcome back. Sean Hudson, uh, one of uh, the friends of this program, I like to think. Sean here, who uh, last, uh, last time was on the program, Sean sang with Noddy Holder. Uh, well, after a fashion, after yeah. After a fashion. Well, I sang behind Naughty Holder. Well, just really. behind and to the left, wasn't it? Yeah, slightly, yeah. Uh, yeah. And yeah. then Wayne, 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 um... Wayne Hussey. Wayne Hussey, yeah. was, was just over there. Yeah. And, uh, yes, you... That, yeah. Was, that was after you maybe do some aerobics with a very large woman. <laughs> like a very, very large woman. Yeah. I'm glad you reminded me of that, because we haven't done aerobics on the show. We must do that again. I'm really pleased yeah. I brought that up. Yeah. yeah. Of course, you're sure you're not here next week on the show. We've got the Dream Girls and them from Adelson. I was most cut off about that. I thought, every, yeah. you know, the week he has to ask me back, and the Dream Girls are on next week. Well, uh, one of the reasons I invited you back was because every time we've done the programme from a different location, yeah. we brought you back. Now, yeah. this is, this is, can we have a look at this? This is the aircraft hangar. This is an old, an old garage, as you can see, and we sort of sit in the middle of it, and uh, there's a lot of space. You don't it's very nice. It's, yeah. it's like doing it like Static like 17, isn't it, with this behind? Yeah, it's got yeah. you, could, you could open the doors over here. You could roll in an elephant if you wanted. <laughs> I don't think you do, but you could, you know. Uh -huh. I should explain, because people are over here wondering, you often see Sean. You, you may well have heard of Sean. If, uh, Sean is one of Britain's best-selling authors. Yeah, I, mean, yeah, yeah, I wasn't going to argue no, with you. Yeah. Believe it or not, he's, he's one of the wealthiest men in the, in the country. No, I will, argue, I will argue with you there. He, he sells books. I mean, it's a difficult thing to sell books. They it's very, it's you know, very difficult, yeah. Straight into the top ten every time you bring a book out. Yes, yes. Hey, he did books that were slugs, was he also that slug? Yes, yeah, slugs was the slugs. first one, yeah. yeah. Some, people might, some people may have seen the film. And we use the word film very loosely there. Yes, it was a loose film. It was pretty, it made me feel pretty loose after yeah. I'd seen it. Yeah. I, yeah. That. Yeah. I mean, for, for instance, you're not here to plug the new book. Because we haven't got a copy of it here, but I mean... No, but, we, we, no, but I will still give a merciless plug, even though we haven't got one. It, yeah. would, it would be called Captives, were it lying there, which it should Captives. Be. Captives yeah. is a new hardback, yeah. It's a story of... Um, well, of captives, basically, James, which makes me feel very much at home in all yes, this mesh. Yes, yes, yes. But it's a, it's a thriller. It's a, it's a I've got to do this for you, have I? It's a story of the London yeah. underworld. Yeah, 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 yeah okay. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's a story of the London underworld, and it's also an attempt to uh, rid us of prison overcrowding, basically, by... Killing them. Well, no, 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 no it's much more okay, subtle right. than that. Sorry so, about that if you're no, watching no, it. No, you, don't moment. give the end away. No, yeah. you... you <laughs> This, this scientist implants a device inside people's brains which he hopes will neutralise their violent tendencies but of course with it being one of my books it works the other way to get massive brain tumours go out and kill people by the handful. Because tastelessness is not something that you go for in the book, is it really? Tasteless, tastelessness, yes, yes. In, a, in a big yeah, way. Oh, you, yeah, this I, is tasteless, this book, is it? Oh, it's tasteless in a really? big way. Oh, God, yeah. Because I yeah. thought Slugs was a very, very delicate sort of study of those rather slimy little it creatures. Did, it, did have, it did have very strong Freudian undertones, actually. Yeah, yeah and a very strong Freudian undertaste, actually. This comes out of your mind, doesn't it? All this sort of, it regurgitates out of this, all that starts yeah. in here somewhere. Yeah, it starts in my mind and it comes out of the reader's stomach. Yeah. Yes, uh, it actually okay. it works its way down. It's a... Because some of the things, actually, if you've not read a Sean book before, you have to. I mean, they are they are books not for the weak, uh, well, weak-minded. I yeah, thought. Yeah, you yeah, were yeah. No, yeah, no, no, no. I mean, <laughs> I mean, for instance, Sean identifies and writes about everybody's fears, which is why he's mm. on the present a little time with the program tonight. Yeah, right, right. He likes to write about bereavement, rape, castration. <laughs> well, I don't actually like to write about it, James, but it's a living. You know? Yeah. <laughs> Eye damage is a big one, isn't it? Yeah, it Gouging is, yeah. out of the eyes is yeah. very, very big as far as you're well, concerned. Well, I've had, a fear, I've had a fear of going blind ever since I was a kid, and if you yes. can see how thick these glasses were, you know why. Uh -huh. but, uh, you're that, halfway there at the I'm moment. Indeed. I yes, yeah, that, Who yeah. said that? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fire and slippery creatures like slugs and yeah. snails, and these, you, you've got a, a phobia about these as well? I've got a phobia about nearly everything, actually, yeah. Well, Including well, flying, strangely enough. You don't, what are you? I'm absolutely terrified of flying, seriously. Why? Well, because I don't want to die for the same reason that woman on the on the plane on the plane yeah. on the plane. But set. you write. I mean, you write about the most great things. This is oh, your chief sorry. steward speaking. The duty-free trolley will be along shortly to pick ah. all the arms. You may pay for goods in sterling by major credit cards or using foreign currency at our extremely unfavourable rates of exchange. <laughs> Unfortunately, owing to lack of space, the items you particularly wanted will not be carried on this flight. Oh damn! There's always a way. I mean, I wanted some of that perfume, and they never have it. <laughs> Now, Sean, of course, as you can probably tell, he's a heavy metal writer, and uh, Sean is, uh, is, if he hadn't been a writer, he would have wanted to be uh, a rock and roll singer. I would indeed. Well, yeah. not a singer, a drummer. A drummer. I, d I do drum in my yeah. spare time. A lot of people have said that my writing style is very yeah. akin to the way I play the drums. Okay, well, as you know, we like to bring really new, uh, yeah. innovative music on the program. You've enjoyed some of the music we've I had. I have indeed, yeah. We have chosen this next video for you because we think it's actually, uh, it, it sums up your taste in music. Oh, um, God, is it that bad? No, uh, it's brilliant. It's going to be a huge success this Christmas. Just watch this over